Hi, Shalisa here. I'm back again with another boss from Dark Souls. I fell down into a creepy tomb, and uh, this is the boss I'm gonna meet Grave Lord Nito. So, this was for me the easiest boss. I'm not sure if I really do it right or anything. I think I do actually because I took it down quite fast. He is very simple though. I'm not sure if he gives you any curse or anything because I didn't get hit by him. So I'm guessing that that might be the reason why he's hard. I come in with my 5 SS flasks. I do not have a divine weapon. I use my uh, Black Knight sword. But I think I have it full upgraded here. I'm not really sure though. As you see, I one-shot them with uh, one swing, these small ones, but he does resurrect them, so... Uh, and I have these big guys too, I think I three-shot them or something like that. But I decided not to bother with them, and just go for Grave Lord Nito, because I see there that, that the uh, skeletons get resurrected. I noticed that he's one of those bosses that is just too big to uh, actually hit me if you go into melee. And he does not take damage unless you are in front of him. I use my wooden ring still to roll around. And this, I use one shot stem to get some time to heal. You see, uh, that didn't really work out for me, but. Yeah, if you go away from him, he does this um, shooting into the ground. Has quite a mighty swing. And you cannot hit him if you're on the side of him because you have to hit his uh, skeletons, his cloak you can't kill him with. Here he goes down and he's gonna do an AoE. As you see this kills the mi uh, minions and this is your chance to start killing him because there's no minions up. As you see he starts respawning them but you get to have some time to get in. He's gonna go down again and then he blows his friends up. That means that you can go in again and start bashing on him. As you see, if you go to the right, his sword will not hit you because he hits to the left. Well, it's his right, but you understand what I mean. Here I stood to the left of him because I was starting to get too much into the wall. That's why I get hit. And he does not have that much HP, so... Just don't care about the small guys, just go for him and you should be fine. This was my actually my easiest kill in Dark Souls. So thank you for watching and subscribe and I'll give you more.